that's how you do it right here. Okay, I need everybody's in rap attention, please. Everybody, please be quiet down. Everybody's attention, please. Everybody's attention. Shh. You know, that worked more than we talked. It's the second time. Second time's always Let me try it again. Shh. There you go. All right. Thanks for coming out to support. Gibson showroom. We thank. Let's give Gibson a round of applause. All right, Gibson. <laughs> what a great guitar company. How many remember uh, Les Paul? Gibson Les Paul, the first of Les Paul. What a great pioneer in the industry. Let's also give it up to him too. Right. Yeah. Right. Okay, I have the privilege to announce someone who's very dear to me. Okay, about three years ago, to hold me a long story. I was teaching a songwriting camp with uh, Greg Hammerstein back there. Greg, raise your hand, Greg, so they can see you, okay? There he is back there. And so, I spotted out this, this gem out of a crowd. And she said, well, I don't sing rock, I don't sing pop or R&B. I only sing country. Really? She said, I'd like to sing something a cappella. So we went back to the Glenwood studio, I heard her a cappella, and she blew me away. Right away I said, where are your parents? I walked outside to the courtyard and talked to them. Three months later, we went to Nashville and recorded great songs with writers who wrote with Faith Hill, Tim McGraw, Martina McBride, and then Celeste started writing herself. And now we have this gem of an artist that's going to change the industry. So, without any delay, please give it up for Celeste Kellogg. Come on, make some noise. <laughs>